Hello and welcome back. And uh, in this video, we're going to be uh, taking a look at the rotation gesture. So let me show you what we're going to build if my uh, build still works. Okay, there we go. So this is what we're going to build as you as you move your uh, multi-touch and uh, around your view that you have added gesture on, and your view is going to basically rotate. Okay, so that's what we're going to build. And uh, I just wanted to correct myself, like you know, in the last video I said like sometimes. Uh, the uh, multi-touch or multi-touch does not work uh, in Canvas. It, it actually does, but uh, what you need to do, sometimes what happens, like, you know, it does not detect the option key when you hold the option key. So what you need to do is hold the option key and tap. If these two dots don't appear, just tap on your uh, view and they'll appear. And then it works just like uh, in simulator. So that was uh, my bad on my part. So uh, I apologize for that. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, get started with this example. So uh, this is gonna be a really simple example. Uh, what we're gonna do is uh, we are simply gonna track the state of a uh, of angle in a variable. So we're gonna simply say uh, state private var, and we're gonna call this one rotation, and it's gonna be of type angle. And initially we're gonna just give it a value zero, and uh, then we're going to create our image. I'm going to use GT logo. I'm going to make this resizable. I'm going to give it a frame. Width and height is 200. I'm going to give it a shadow as well. And then uh, we're going to apply uh, rotation, first rotation effect. So we can, uh, whatever value is observed, can actually apply that inside the rotation effect and then we can apply our gesture and here uh, we are going to create rotation value is going to give us uh, the angle and we are simply going to say self dot rotation is equal to value okay and that's it. So if you resume, you're gonna notice that if you hold your option key and you rotate, your view actually rotates with you. All right, so this is it for uh, this video. Uh, in the next video, we're gonna start exploring um, these gesture compositions. Uh, there's like, you know, the advanced state of uh, gesture combination uh, that CPI introduced. So we're going to start exploring them one by one to see how they work, right? So thanks again for watching. I will see you guys in the next video.